Hello, and good evening to everybody out there. Circuit Main here, and we are going to be doing a couple of Steam events for Halloween. You can already tell that it's pretty dark out here. And what better way to scare the crap out of people than to scare the crap out of myself? So, the first one is going to be System Shock 2, which is one that I've been eager to do a Halloween stream on. Fortunately, uh, looks like I had to wait all the way till Halloween to play it. But, all, the, for, all for the better, let's go ahead and give it a shot. Bring it up. Now, I already did play this a little bit. The intro is takes a little bit, but I should be able to go through it fairly fast. Look at you, hacker. A p pathetic creature of meat and bone. Panting and, panting and sweating as you run through my corridors. How, how can you challenge a perfect, immortal machine? Boy, I'm feeling confident already. Booga booga. In 2072, a rogue artificial intelligence known as Shodan lost her mind. In her limitless imagination, Shodan saw herself as a goddess destined to inherit the earth. That image was snuffed out by the hacker who created her. Well, that was easy. Oh, no way, we're on System Shock 2! The sequel! Military! Science holding hands. February 3rd, Truly, the, the future is upon us. The Von Braun, the first starship in history capable of traveling at faster than light speed, will undertake her maiden voyage. This incredible journey is the result of teamwork between the UNN Protectorate and the incredible scientific minds of the newly relicensed Trioptimum Corporation. Why is it every time something Imagine goes faster than light, it ends up going really, really bad? A period of weeks. It's all part of Triop's commitment to the future. The Von Braun is packed with over 1.8 billion flight, scientific, and security systems. And you can Here tell, they got awesome graphics. And its wholly owned subsidiaries. Providing security for the Von Braun as she plows through the heavens will be... My god! Those faces! Her helm will be no less than Captain William... Oh, uh, what do you want? 1990s, himself, I think. ...the Battle of Boston Harbor during the Eastern States Police Action. This incredible union of government police action. No, 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 no. It wasn't a war. It was police action. Mechanisms that will allow the Rickenbacker to piggyback its way into jump space. Sleek. Fast. Revolutionary. Who knows what wonders await our crews in the bosom of the cosmos. All we do know is that it's a great day for mankind. And it's a hell of a bosom, too. The biggest bosom ever. Bosom, bosom. I suddenly wish I had some booze. Oh, well. Oh, something went wrong. Want to make a bet? Nobody makes it mentions that. <laughs> Ooh, now we're going to the loading screen. Hello, welcome to our world. Welcome to the Ramsey Center UNN recruitment facility. Please watch your step when leaving the train. The grav shafts at the end of the hall will take you to the street level training and recruitment center. Please proceed to the grav shafts. All right, step well, into the grav shafts to proceed to the street level recruitment. No, go down. Okay. Admittedly, this was pretty awesome. Just jump in there. Ooh, look at you go. Wee. I think we're in Japan. Alright. And yes, we got the wonderful 1990s graphics up res because graphics and computer. Before you choose your career, you'll want to learn some basic abilities. First, you should go into the basic training center. When you're done with basic training, proceed. If you've completed basic training, you're yeah, ready da, for the da, 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 da. Here's where you make your choice, soldier. Here's where you enlist in one of the three branches of the military. Once you decide on your branch of service, there's no going back. A shuttle See. will take you to a UNN orbital space station, where you'll receive a briefing regarding your yearly postings. Good Yay. luck. So, we got Marines, the Navy, and the OSA. Let's go with the acronym.
Whee! Of course, the cutscene doesn't change, no matter which one you pick. Then we're accessing... Oh, I suddenly plopped out of nowhere. Now, mission postings. Now, here is where things can just change around for you. We we. The OSA welcomes you to Orbital Station Chun Lo. Ready yourself to feel the limitations of your mind slipping away. We will guide your path over the next four years. The shuttle base at the center of the station will ferry you to your next stage of growth. When you've chosen, head into the appropriate shuttle bay. Wah, okay. Get ready to learn things you have never imagined. All right, the first part of the tutorial it just pretty much gives you you do this to shoot. Do this for equipment. Do this for fun. Oh dear crap. Crappity crap crap crap. Any case, now you can actually uh, change up your person a little bit. You can see three different things here. The sensory deprivation tanks aboard the TOS Chu Lun are modulated for your training. Blah blah you blah. Shall spend a year but if you look at the top there, you can see gain two T T. Let's you can see. This um, gains me two side disciplines. This. This the one gives me. Tanks aboard the TOS Runang await the, you. Oh, it gives me all the same thing. Uh, the crowd kinetics and will grant you power kinetic over redirection. It. The sensory deprivation okay, tanks so it looks like the, the um, option I chose gave you. me psi abilities. There you will spend a solitary year so the OSC is meditation on motion and uh, sound and how they may serve your will. Let's see, psycho. Look, no wait, psychokinetic cyber affinity. Ah, screw it. We'll just go the with this. The sensory deprivation tanks aboard the TOS Runang await you. Wow, wow. Oh, look at those graphics, man! Whoa! Whoa! Oh! <coughs> mm. That's good voice. <coughs> I probably should have put myself in a uh, quiet sta Oh, well, hopefully. This ah. Years of training in the Arnog is finished. Your will has grown. Your mind can freeze your foes in the tracks and pull distant objects to you. These talents will serve you well. Second tier disciplines are now within your grasp. Do not take your skills into the field to pit them against your enemies. You master two tiers, cryokinetics and kinetic redirection. Now let's see here. Your now we got two endurance, Dr. one research, Sifting and two psionic. Of psionic. Disloyalty from the morass of emotion and internal conflict that fill Blah 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 blah. And then we get to watch Cubehead watch it watch us fly away. Time has served. You, you've you become. Let's see. I had sired under a layer of quite explicit daydreams, but you were not deceived. Near the end, you felt the presence of a fading that. There. Stuff. Next. Many see, threats to security can only be defeated. One strength, one agility, inside. one cyber affinity. In the grand scheme, individuals are Let's no see. more important than pieces one on a game board. One strength, one. Occasionally, oh, it and neural reflex dampening. Acts of Remote electron and, and psychogenetic ability. In the grand Let's see. Many threats to security. Can Remote electron be tampering. Mine shall be carefully black. I shall I shall interfere with so many electrons. I think I don't know. I feel like I'm just guessing at this point. We. Yeah, this first part's a little bit boring. Admittedly, tutorial crap. Now the fun part begins. You and Rickenbacker. Why? Why do they always name ships like weird things? Rickenbacker, Strudelbaker, Arnold Schwarzy Hopper, Make Mako Sunako. Um, target this one here. Be ready to become part of history. Shuttle Bay 2. Aboard, Yay! Shuttle Bay 2! Five months later, you and in Von Braun near Tau Ceti, 67 trillion miles from Earth, and no taco stand. Hmm, what's 
see a worm. I guess I'm just chilling out there. Chill out my pod, man. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, crap. Restoring patient memory. Restoring memory. Restoring memory. Wait, restoring memory? Wow. That's an interesting way to cryogenically freeze and then am amnesia someone. You have no memory! Steady yourself, soldier. This is Dr. Janice Polito of the computer ops staff of the Von Braun. You're safe for the time being. You're recovering from the effects of surgery and will be unable to remember any of the events of the last few weeks. You'll look like You're a horrible graphics the ghost. Starship Von Braun and something's gone very, very wrong. You think? Some kind of force has hijacked this ship. That's why you volunteered to be implanted with some experimental cybernetic implants. Oh my god. Your cyber interface These graphics are horrible, but... <laughs> you must find an elevator and come up to Deck 4 to meet me. Deck 4. Can you remember that? But keep your eyes open. They're after us both now. Deck 4. Hike! Alright, let's see if I can change this up a little bit here. Admittedly, it's a little bit dark. I'm going to see if I can up the graphics. Of the let's see. Yes, Gamma just. I really got to get a, a, better, a new monitor. This thing is... Watch out. I'm getting strange readings from that radar dish outside the window. It's become unstable due to... Move! Take cover! Okay, run this way. Loot this body. Wait. Okay, also... There we go, crowd kinetis. Kineticis. Oh! Oh, huh, that's funny. You are supposed... Ah, that's... Okay, just gotta tap. That works! Run! Run for your life! <laughs> Not like the game would actually kill you if you took a little lot time. Let's see. And there's dead body. Let's see. Oh right, it was this. Great. I gotta change the access codes out of cryo A again. Like I've got nothing better to do. I think Man. just likes to make work for me. I'll set the new code to 45100. Zero zero. That should be easy enough to remember. Quickly! Ooh! Well, that kind of sucks. Alright, let's see. And there is our crouch. Warning. Decompression event imminent. Please move immediately to cryo recovery B. Decompression Hurry! Event I must. Imminent. Ooh. Okay then. All right. Let's see here. This power cell is dead. There should be a recharger nearby. Just use it, and it will recharge all the power-driven devices in your possession. After you've recharged the cell, plug it into the auxiliary power unit. That should open the airlock door. Be quick about it. The vacuum seals won't hold up much longer. Hurry! Hurry up now, damn you! You've managed to get out before the whole area depressurized. I've just uploaded wow, you some I felt cybernetic so modules. You can use them to upgrade your cybernetic rig at the upgrade units in this area. There are four types of units in the next room. One for each subsystem of your cybernetic gear. Stats, psi, weapons, and tech. But use the modules carefully. They're hard to come by. In other words, be careful how you level. No duh. Ooh, information. 
Let's see. So we got an elevator. We got another dead body. We got random crap falling from the sky. Let's see here. Tech. Stats. Psy. And weapon. Well, since I'm already going Psy, let's see what we can Psy up, huh? Let's see. Whoops. I think I just activated that. Oh well, I guess a little bit of agility never hurt anyone. Let's see. And let's see, increase your cyber by two. Yeah, we'll go with that one. Always good to beef up your defenses. Now, tick me up, elevator! Cram! Okay, nobody saw that, right? Nobody? Okay, good. Let's try that again without throwing myself off a cliff, huh? Okay. Now, there is a reason, though, that I am in interested in this. Side so shield, side. So See, I think. Yeah, I think I pull out to do it. Okay, fine. <laughs> See, so you get a speed booster and six standard bullets. Hooray! Free gun stuff. See, admittedly, this is a little bit annoying to get the psi abilities up. Eh, maybe I should have stuck with a gun. Shoot things! That'll solve my pro any problems anywhere! Huh. Guess I can't open that door. I can, however, go through here. Let's see. Obviously, don't want to go exploring too much, because we only got... Let's see. Well, we've been at this for about 20 minutes, so we got plenty of time to do things so you can see all the fun that this game has to offer, one way or another. Let's see. Good. You've managed to get out before the whole area depressurized. I've just uploaded you some. This power cell is dead. There should be a recharger nearby. Just use it and it will recharge all the power driven devices in your possession. After you've recharged the cell, plug it into the auxiliary power unit. That should open the airlock door. Be quick about it. The vacuum seals won't hold up much longer. Wah, wah, wah. Oh, dear God. Okay. So I guess that was. Um, I think I already went that way too. Yeah. Okay, I gotta get back up in the elevator again. This time I actually go somewhere. Take me up. Watch out! I got a ball! And I know how to squeeze it! I know how to play with balls. I've got big balls! I've got big balls! Please, let me out of here. Yep. Ghosts. Hope you're not afraid of no ghosts, because we're going to be dealing with them whether you like it or not. Huh, not sure what I did there. Let's check up in here, huh? Spooky, scary, I'm shooting everything up. And apparently somebody decides to knock on my door at the worst time.
thumbs up next time. I did. I'm like, good for her. <laughs> Well, it looks like a trick or treater caught notice of one of my ponies and said, "Awesome!" Hey, can't argue with that. Now, if only I can get a big girl to say, "I want to be your Mac Daddy. I want you to be my Mac Daddy. Be my coochie coo." All right, let's see. Now I know there's supposed to be. See, I examined all the bodies. Did, did I pick up the card and not realize it? Let's see. Oh, I guess. I'm uploading some more modules. Now this is when things start to get crazy. Because now we actually have evil things coming after us here. brains. Did he actually say brains? Hmm, that would work beautifully here, actually. Just shit! Are we joined? That hurt. <laughs> I wasn't scared. Oh gee, I wonder what in the world could have possibly happened. Maybe he infected the entire crew! Admittedly, that is actually even spookier than anything that you could ever normally make. That is... On most decks you'll find a quantum bio-reconstruction device. Xerxes shut them all down, but I've discreetly put them back online. You'll need to interface with each machine locally to provide a quantum entanglement sample. Once you do that, the device will be able to rebuild your body essentially from scratch. It's not pleasant, but it's preferable to slow decomposition. So, essentially, there are restore points. Okay. Not quite done exploring here yet. Hmm. No idea what that is. Insipid computer Xerxes has shut down the elevator as well. You can transfer power at the engine core on deck one, which will get the elevator up and running again. But you can't use the elevator to get down there. Wait. There's some kind of maintenance access right on this hallway. You can use it to reach deck one. However, it's locked, and Xerxes is hiding the passcode from me. Dr. Watts should have the code. He's probably in the crew subsection. Grassi has the key to get in there, but he's in the medical subsection, probably near the biopsy lab. Now get to the medical subsection and find Grassi. This is Xerxes. Please report any unauthorized database interactions to your direct superior. Remember, a smooth operation is everybody's responsibility. Yep. Say hello to our evil guy right there. Spooky as hell, isn't it? Yeah. 
Somebody's hacked into this thing again. I'm gonna tell Delacroix. Well, I guess he didn't get too far before telling him. Okay, we've got a P another PDA here. What do we got? I've been unable to get in touch with Delacroix. This place... Xerxes has control of the ship's security system. Avoid or destroy any security cameras you see. You can have security computers to power down the cameras too, if you're good enough. But don't watch the job, or you'll set off the door yourself. Your corpse is useless to me. Oh, shit. Okay. The problem is I don't know how many are here or how many are going to respond. I'm just glad I got frozen balls of death. <laughs> Damn it! Who wants to make a bet that I'm going to end up wiping out the entirety of... Wow. Okay, I got a problem here. This is not good. Not good. Wow, that did not go well. Ah! Oh, come on. I don't I can't even hold a gun. Ah, kind of loud. Okay, let me see here. What do I got? Hmm. Fortunately, my cat my camera is actually covering up the one little area that would tell me what in the hell that is. But it looks like it's medical, so that's not going to help. Maybe this. This isn't good. Okay. Well, I guess I'm going to have to go at this a little blind. Yes. Yeah, I doubt that was going to work. Alright. Well, I'm not completely screwed. I'm just not in a good position now. Let's try checking out the bed. Bay. Damn. The power outage has also taken out access to this bulkhead. It's the only way to get to the medical subsection. Pick up the battery from the floor and find a recharger. The one you used before is in hard vacuum now, I'm afraid. But there should be another one on this deck. Once you get the battery recharged, place it in the auxiliary override. I'm supposed to get past that damn camera. I can't even see it without it seeing me. Potential threat detected. Potential threat detected. Pot of plant. Ah, the pot of plant. Eyes are open. 
Luckily, you guys are idiots. Thank you. Mm. Is there No, it's fails. Beat everything with a branch and run. Okay. All right. I'm. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Well, at least the sodas will help a little bit here. Oh, mama, that's what I was looking for. <laughs> I really don't know why I have those things, to be honest. there. Let's see. Oh. Wrong ability. Wait, help! Sign monkey! Sign monkey! How's there a sign monkey? monkey. Freaking attacked by a Psy monkey. And he didn't even have anything. You're useless, monkey. You were useless in life and, and, and death. Marie, I've got to restrict access to engineering until we can figure out what to do down there. It's just too hot. I don't know where all the hazard suits went, so I'm reading oh, to bring down an armful of rad hypos. Those damn things always give me a headache. Okay, yeah. Ever since we reached Tau Seti, the lab monkeys have been acting strangely. Nurse Lesser picked one out of a case to be brought in for vivisection, and the rest of them, I mean the entire group, stood up on their legs and howled. This wasn't just a random display. It was a protest. Nothing like rave music to make you really wonder what the heck is, is going on. Yeah, I didn't think that would work. And he's empty. Okay, let's see. How about you, random body that died in a horrible, horrible way? Let's see. Version 1 research software. I can go with that one. Wait, what? Did I? What? Huh? We seek. We seek.
Hmm, I wonder if those guys can go up ladders or not. Doesn't matter. You die! You die! And leave a horrible corpse, you horrible bastards. Okay, let's see. Wow, I should have just been a hacker. I would have been at front of the damn place at this point. Thank you for having exactly what I need. Yeah, that's the stuff. And a little bit of health. These missions should have been scrapped before it left Earth. We've been unable to contain the reactant coolant leaks on deck one. I've put an order requiring acid suits down there. I know you think this would cause a panic. But it's better than giving everybody radiation sickness, don't you think? Okay, now I might be in trouble. Let's make sure I didn't miss anything in here. Okay. Let's see. I almost feel like I should be able to get in there somehow. No, well. Let's see. Okay, running around, running around. Die. Oh. Each deck has a chemical storeroom where you can find the resources you need to research the artifacts you'll find around the ship. Don't try to carry around all the chemicals at once. It Lots of chemicals. Oh, I see. It's just telling me what I needed, what I had in here, okay? You killed him! He could have been my friend! I could have called him George or Whitney or Whitley George! We could have been friends and I could have used them to take your blunt hits for a little while! You maniac! You suck! Oh, this is that room I was looking at earlier. And that's how I fall into the room I was looking at earlier. And I think I recall this being a really horrible room. This is Yeah, that's what I thought. I have to keep coming back into the room with the weird gate hanging guy there, huh? Yeah, okay. Now I forgot where in the world I how in the world I got there. No, it wasn't this way. You did, you did. Let's see. Oh crap, I've already been by here. I 
feel like I want to miss. Oh yeah, I died over here. Damn, that's why I died over here. Damn it. Oh yeah, I died here. Oh yeah, that's why. Brilliant. Armor piercing, piercing bullets. Okay, I feel like I chose a really tough road with just being sorry. Admittedly, this is one of the more annoying things, where you have no clue what in the world, where in the world you're going anymore. Because you really need a map sometimes. Yeah, it was over here. At least you guys are plentiful. Plenty of nanites. There. Okay, um... That'll give me a few more. And... just to be safe. idea if that's hitting you. Nope. Okay, heal up. Alright, I think I'm free to explore now. Pretty sure there was an easier way to do that, I just don't know it. Alright, recharge the battery, and now I can go back to that other place. Okay. So, we can actually proceed to the next map here before we run out of time. Boy! Oh, wait, why didn't I think of that? Let's see here. Problem is, it's a pain in the butt to switch the uh, psi abilities here. Alright, let's see. Alright, now, think, think, think. Hmm. Let's see. It was the med bay. I remember the 
med bay. I am not dealing with your crap. Okay. Oh, yeah, maybe that wasn't the battery. No, it was. Well done. I'm uploading some more modules. Yes! And we've uploaded modules! Good. You've managed to get into Med. Now find Grassy and get the keycard to the crew sector. He's the one who monitored your cryo sleep, so he might be interested in joining you. If he hasn't been butchered yet. Intruder entering medical center A. Oh crap, crap, crap! Intruder, the many demands to know your intentions. Are you allied with her? You do not know of her intentions. No! No! Why? Why? Why do I suck? Oh, come on! Let's try that again. Good. You've managed to get into med. Now find Grassy and get the key code to the crew sector. He's the one who monitored your cryo sleep, so he might be interested in joining you if he hasn't been butchered yet. Are you allied with her? Do you not know of her intentions, of her history? She once tried to destroy your species, and now you do her bidding. Intruder entering medical sector A. Why do I keep hearing monkeys? Swear I'm going crazy in there. Just keep hearing monkeys. Monkeys! Our health up benches. Nice. I can get used to that. I swear, you just have the you just know the psychotic monkeys around. You might witness some strange phenomena. Your R grade cyber rig has an experimental perception enhancement that can theoretically detect residual psychic emanations. These emanations traditionally come from the recently dead. Literature might call them ghosts. I call them self-hypnotic defects in the R-grade unit. Don't let it distract you from the job at hand. Potential threat detected. Potential threat detected. Where? Ah, help! Monkey! 
Rocky! Rocky! <laughs> There's more than one monkey! This sucks! Monkeys! Freaking monkeys! I'm gonna die by monkey! Good. I freaking die by monkey! I don't believe this crap. Freaking brain monkeys. Sucks. Fuck! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Fuck a monkey! Ah! What the hell? Fuck a monkey! those hypos. <laughs> Dang it. Send you to evil monkeys. It's Planet of the Apes all over again. This is almost worse than when I had to face Gary! You have got to be kidding me. I'm kind of screwed anyway in this play. Well, 
well, actually, I didn't go down here, so I guess I can check this out. Completely screwed. That's right, stupid monkey. Bag of potato chips. Well, that's just great. Okay, so I got some Psy. And I obviously do not want to go out through there. Okay. Alright, so two minutes left. Let's let's go in crazy here, huh? See how far I can make it uh, here. Oh, man, that would have been so awesome to have. Wait, they're doing the same thing I am! <coughs> Eat my cold shoulder, you son of bitches! killed himself and I got an odd object out of the monkey why not Let's see here oh boy more magic and body armor I got freaking armor <laughs> Unfortunately, that pretty much is where it ends, huh? Okay. So, that's System Shock 2 there. Now, for those of you who are interested, I'm not sure if it's going to be on a, ha on a Halloween sale right now, but if you're looking at it at normal, System Shock actually runs at about... Um, oh, I think it is on a Halloween sale right now. It's about $2.50 right now. Let me double check here. It's $2.50 right now, but I think it's normally like a $10 game. Yeah, normally $10. This is actually a pretty old game. Um, I don't know, maybe 10, 15 years old, maybe even older than that. Looks like, yeah, it was about, um, it was made almost 15 years ago, August 11, 1999. There's plenty of mods for it out now, so if you want to up it, there's definitely plenty of ways to do it. Otherwise, it is pre a pretty spooky game, pretty freaky. It does kind of mess with you a little bit there. I'd say give it a shot. You know, if if you really liked, if you really like Bioshock, this is the granddaddy to Bioshock, and it definitely shows exactly how crazy it is. Because oh dear world, it's still, 
It's got a little bit of action, but it spooks the crap out of you at the same time. In any case, uh, that is uh, one part of our Halloween uh, Circuit Steam event. Uh, join us in about half an hour, and we'll have the next game, which will be Ghostbusters. I hope you enjoy that one, too. And uh, if you don't, uh, I hope you have a good night.